Okay guys, it's Friday, so I thought I'd show you one of my favourite uh, tools for making Fridays go easier. Uh, one of the tasks I get in the workshop all the time is trying to pull stuck dowels out of cylinders. This guy sent me a cylinder in the post and it's still got the dowels in there. They'll be in there because he couldn't get them out. Now I've got to try and get it out. Normally you just grab them, give them a bit of a twist and they'll, they'll come out. Uh, sometimes that doesn't happen and it's usually because water and stuff gets down in there and causes a bit of corrosion or whatever uh, but we've got to get it out we don't want to damage them because it's Friday afternoon if we go to a bike shop they're not going to have them in stock they're only ten dollars but they're never around when you need them uh, this is a great set of uh, dowel pin pullers I got from Motion Pro I think I actually bought them off uh, Ballard's or MX store, whatever it is now. Uh, it's a great kit because 8, 10, 12, 14, and for some of the weird and wonderful KDMs, I've had to make a, uh, a little converter for a, uh, I think it's a 11 mil uh, thing, which I just made up a little bush and can put it in there. I can take it out and use it for a 14, or I can leave that in there. In the future, I'll probably have to make other ones, but that makes the kit more complete. The, com the kit comes set mostly for the, all the Japanese bikes and this will cover 90 you know percent of everything you ever need. Now you can use this thing a couple of different ways. You can see it's a 10 mil dowel pin. Select a 10 mil, put it on there. I push it down to get as much engagement as you can. Give it a, give it a twist tighten it up and you can use this one or two ways you can either put the the screw in the back and use a slide hammer or you can just use this handle if it's not too stuck which that one isn't you can pull it out that was real easy they're not all easy pretty sure this other one's stuck a lot worse it's done up get the slide hammer arrangement set up just push on there and give it a couple of taps and she's out the more stubborn ones you can put a bit of heat on here with a hot air gun or a little butane torch if you're careful and it'll help release it. Great tool, great product. I did look up to see how much they were on uh, MX Store or Ballard's and I think it's $130 or just under. Really good value thing. Every dowel that you have to replace is about 10 bucks now. You know, everything's eight, nine, ten dollars. And if it you can get it out and back in without having to go to the bike shop to replace it, it's a great thing. So $130 tool. If you're in a workshop, it's an awesome thing. If you just like doing things the right way, it's not a very expensive item. Uh yeah, I recommend it highly. One of my favorite things. Alright, guys, have a great weekend.